thought it is time to start a career and start a new apprenticeship in Germany. There was just one thing standing in Miriam's way. It was the dream of coming to America. And so Miriam made plans to visit her sister in Alabama and travel for the first time to America. Like something that can only be scripted for a movie. A girl from Germany with a dream of coming to America and a kid from Colorado with a dream of being a Black Hawk helicopter pilot in the Army. Both happened to be in Florida on the same day at the same natural spring and as luck might have it although i'd like to believe it was fate miriam came up from under the crystal clear blue water and was greeted by a wide blue-eyed army pilot both jeremy and miriam immediately were captivated by each other some say that love is the strongest force in the universe and that when love is sacrificial and pure, nothing can stand in its way. America gave me the opportunity to start a new profession and make true my dream. I can't wait to start. And this is why we are coming to you here today. Miriam is trying to receive a student visa to follow her passion of becoming a vet tech. The problem is, is that that requires her to come up with $25,000 to sit in her bank account to be eligible for her visa. At this very moment, Miriam is at the U.S. Embassy in Germany, pleading her case to come to America. There is a closely held belief that America is a shining city on a hill standing firm as a beacon of hope that radiates throughout the world. It has always been, though, the American people, just like individuals at a concert, holding up a lighter that makes up that torch that illuminates the path to the land of opportunity and freedom. wanted to go to law school and follow in his father's footsteps in becoming a lawyer. So after graduating high school, Stephen enrolled in Colorado Christian University. Many people asked him if he was going to try out for the baseball team there. And even though he was good enough to play baseball at CCU, Stephen knew that he would never make it past playing college baseball. So Stephen would answer, no, I am going to join the debate team instead to prepare for law school and joined the debate team he did. Four years seemed to fly by, and the time had come to choose which law school to attend. Stephen was offered various scholarship op options at universities like Alabama, Minnesota, and Ohio State, among others. So like anyone trying to pick a school, Stephen set out to visit some of those universities. The GPS was set for South Bend, Indiana, home of Notre Dame University. There is a saying that Notre Dame is your home under the dome for all who attend the storied university. Well, Stephen quickly found that to be the case for him. From the minute he arrived in South Bend and drove on campus, seeing the bright gold dome, Stephen knew that he was home. So he committed to Notre Dame and started his law school journey in August of 2016. 